Hello everyone and welcome back to the Pokemon Y. Oh, randomizer Nuzlocke with your boy Shady Sin. Welcome to episode 20. We are 20 episodes into this uh, journey through um, the Kalos region. In the last episode, guys, we made our way here to Route 14. And we battled, obviously, our rival, rival Serena. And we are about to head our way towards... Um, um, what's the town called? It's not I keep thinking of like Love Ridge from Gen 3, but it's not. Oh, what's it? Gen? Um, I can't remember. Right, wherever the fairy gym is. I'm sure, I remember. I'm sure once I get there, I'll be gutted that I can't remember the name. All right, so in today's episode, we'll be just going on, making our way through Route 14. If you're hyped for today's episode, please like, comment, and subscribe for slight, slightly much more content, I guess. <laughs> um, oh. Here's a team quick quick team recap for ya. We have, oh man, I've got the hiccups. Adrian, level 39, with Shadow Punch, Shadow Ball, Psychic, and Hypnosis, holding the Juicy Spook Plate. We have Red 41, with Fury Cutter, Metal Claw, Cut, and X, newly acquired, actually. Uh, X is a, um, with holding the Scissorite, so you can Mega Evolve. We have Crocachu, the Blastroids, holding the Mystic Water with Surf, Bite, Aqua Tail, and a Skull Bash. Then we have a Katara with a Spark, Thunder Fang, Cybeam, Bite, Rock in the Rocky Helmet. Rocky, Rocky Helmet, I don't know. <laughs> that was good. Uh, we have Skylar holding the holding the Adamant Orb with Flight, Air Slash, Crunch, and Hyper Voice, knowing that he doesn't have any Dragon type moves. And finally, we have Darkness Level 40 for Blue Wind, Air Slash, Snarl, and Roost holding the Expert Belt. Get rid of that. Power. Alright, so I'll stick you in the back. I'll get Adrian up to level 40, and then I'll just go from there. I decided to start off with a nice, with a nice slide. Nice slip and slide. Okay, okay, okay. Alright, let us divulge ourselves into this route. If I remember correctly... Oh, I'm getting flashbacks from... I'm getting flashbacks from Gen, Gen 4 with the marshlands. I'm so glad you were not our encounter. Oh. I am very glad that you were not our encounter, Mr. Spindar, because you are absolutely shit. If I go to Spindar... Uh, why are the... I'm getting a lot of relic stuff, so I feel like... I need to figure out where you sell those. Because then if I sell, I'll have so much money, I'll be able to, like, accessorize the living shit out of me. Oh, hello. Hello there, Mr. Uh, Mrs. Mr. Mrs. Mega Medichan. How are you doing? How you doing? Just, just praying, bruh. Just, uh... Just, uh, just out here, having living my best life. Alright, okay, I see you, big dog. I mean, I could repel, to be honest. I think I might do that. I think I might repel. You reckon that's a good idea? Do you really think that's a good idea? I don't think so. I think... Holy shit, I've got so much stuff. Holy hell, what the... I guess. Um, I did explore around um, Lumios. Nothing really, really, except I found the TM for... Um, Dragon Tail? Is that the one? Dragon Tail? Oh, hello, Spirit Team. Uh, Dragon Tail, it was... Re it was... Triple kick, if I remember correctly. Triple kick. Uh, I think only Rayquaza and Crocachu, the uh, Blastroids, could learn it. The Blastroids could learn it. So, honestly, not a good TM, if I'm being honest. Not, no, a good TM feels something better. I would have loved to have Rayquaza learn freaking. I don't know. Oh shit, that's not good. Are you fucking kidding me? Fuck. I should have known that was gonna happen. Oh my god. Are you going to suck punch me again? Yeah, I might have to uh, timestamp that, whatever that timestamp is. <laughs> K. 
cut that out. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, uh, that's... That's rough. He was so good as well. Jesus, man. That's just... That's just cut me. That's just cut me deep. Ah, fuck that hurt. Ah, shit, my desk. Stop it. Oh... Oh, he's such a unique typing as well. <sighs> oh my god, my brother is actually going to... Oh, and you're so good at catching Pokemon as well. Oh, crying out loud. Look at him waddling. Oh, that's just cut me. <sighs> who the f who the who the hell do I even add in this situation? Um. Fire Psychic or Grass type. Or add Golurk. Or does that Dark Run go screw everything? And Rock Three Legends. Um, I think for team's sake. I'm gonna put in the. Go go for now. I'm just gonna put the go go in there. Um, for now, and then at the end of the episode, I will figure it, figure it out. I will figure it out. I can't believe it. I can't believe it. I can't believe I've done this. I can't believe it. That is actually, that is rough. Sorry. I should have known about that. I should have known. Oh, that's just... My day is immeasurable. Wow, this is very... Very slow. Ah, oh, that's cool. Oh, that's just... Ah, oh, that's unfortunate. <laughs> unfortunate, jeez. Oh, man. Oh, I should have switched. Oh, Gengar's so good. Oh, man. That's cut me deep. That has actually cut me deep. I don't think I'm going to really recover from this. Oh, great. I got a... A flying type out of a pop type. Okay. Alright, I'm actually kind of down to use a go-go. Go... go, go, go. Go go, so like, um, because I never really used one before, did I? My original when I played this originally? Because I'm pretty sure I picked Del Fox, Fennekin. I picked Fennekin when I played this because me and my brothers had like the system because there's three of us, actually, four, but the three of us that played Pokemon, we were like, oh yeah, we'll pick different times because I always used to pick order, so. And my other brother used to pick grass most of the time. So we decided to mix it up. One gen and I picked fire. So I'm pretty sure I picked that. I don't know if I used it. Did I use a grass type? I can't remember if I used the grass type actually. I wish I could just slap an experience share on him. And not have to worry about the rest of my entire team leveling up as well. Because most of my team is actually kind of... Kind of choice. Okay, it's so not there. Gotta remember that, gotta remember that. So I'm thinking I switch train for now. Gogo's just gonna be chilling in the back. 
I don't know if I'll add him to the layout, I might, depending on how I feel. Mega, no, Mega Save while I was next. Oh, you're going to pursue me, aren't you? You are 100% going to pursue me, but I can't stand. That's a big... That's a big, uh, big no-no. Okay, he didn't pursue me. Actually, it gets me a bit worried because now... <sighs> I'm always tired when I record, and I don't know why. Oh yeah, Shadow Sneak, okay. Um, doesn't make any sense though. Um, yeah, I feel like I'm going to get... Gogo's going to get trapped in one time and I'm not going to be able to save him. Damn. That's a lot of damage. Whoop. Bada boom. Alright. We're getting there slowly, slowly. Slowly, slowly. Bunnelby. I would let you stay in, but I think Bunnelby's gonna... Okay, my, uh... Go-go here. Maybe not, actually. Maybe not. Maybe I can beat him and take all that juice experience. Or maybe not. I don't know. Kind of hard to tell. If I think about it. If I... Oh. Flailing away. Like you just don't care, boy. That's right, you're not a ground type yet. That's me until you dig his bee. Yeah, you're level 21. Yeah. Yeah. Maybe if I just get like that. No, 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 no. No, 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 we don't do that here. Um, is there any hidden items around here? I probably should be checking for hidden items, to be honest. Um, the spook house is on the right. Hello, game. Having a good time? Hey, buddy, can I battle you? Cheers, broski. Cheers, broski. Botanist Scott sends out. Honestly, this swine up could probably beat my uh, go go. Then again, here's a nice type Pokemon. Well, I, okay. Okay, I'm clearly, clearly, I am very much sleep deprived and. <laughs> nah, it's all good. It's all good. It's all good. I'm just imagining the minute I see Sucker Punch, I just hear, hello, darkness, my old friends. I know I reference that a lot, but. That's what I imagine would have happened. Hello, darkness, my old friend. As the screen just went black and... Um... He just died. Wow, I wish I could kill this... Um... Um... Gulpin real quick. Then again, it is raining, so I think I'll be fine. <laughs> um, yeah. Oh, losing Gengar is so bad. Pample. He was like my special wall, maybe. And he gave me immunity to ground. But then again, I have like two flying types that are immune to ground, so. I guess that's what you would say is. Very awkward for me, actually. Um. Now, do I train... What's his face up? Afterwards. That's what I'm trying to figure out here. So there's a lady standing over there. I don't know what she... I'm sorry, don't I have a repel... Oh yeah, I got him out the front. That's right. I'm actually kind of afraid that I'm not going to be able to run away. Is that a worthwhile... Worthwhile thing to say? Then I'm worried. Bonk. <laughs> okay. We run away now. Oh, there's a little... Hello. Do I like fairies? 
Do fairies have tails, or is that a story? Is that a nice type? Because go goats, goating out of here, going, going to goat out it. Okay. Okay. Maybe I should have added a fire type. <laughs> That's right. I got four. Oh, what's, uh, I guess I could have added. I guess in a sense I could have added Golurk, Ground, Ghost, because then it's the wrong move. Wow, that's impressive. You don't see that very often. You don't see that very often. Huh. I've been frozen. By vanilla. This is absurd, even. Damn, three turns as well. Whoa. I mean, I could have just healed, but I know that this guy is literally not going to. Oh my goodness, yep, I'm healing. No. So here's a, here's a problem I'm in, mean, right? I was frozen. How did I move? I don't know if this is like, I can literally just use a thing, but I kind of want to wake up so I don't waste it, but then I'm still, you guys see what I'm saying. I don't even have those. I don't have a full restore though. I need a full restore. I know it's a waste of full restore, but you know what? don't worry about it. It's fine. Everything's fine. It's fine. If you freeze me again, first turn, I will actually, okay, good. Plus six, the new light with... Um, an ice beam that could um, freeze me. I want to be freezing. Freezing? Freezing? Prime 8. That's a lot of experience that I would love to have. I know it's kind of a risky way to play, but I kind of need the experience. But I guess in a Sense. I should be fine? Question mark. I guess I can always just slap it up and um. Okay, assurance. That was very nice of you. I love the assurance that you gave me. But boink, he's gone. He's out. He's been sent back to the dojo. To work on his martial arts abilities. Wow, you have a very interesting moveset. I first check what TMs are going actually, now I think about it. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Check those TMs, bro. The TMs, I might check that later actually. I'll check that later when I am not getting whacked or flacked. Okay, I'll do this. I think I didn't take cut off scissor, scissor, slide, sliding. Oh my god, I am getting the most garbage TMs you have ever seen in your life. <laughs> Why are these TMs so shit? Can I run away from a low tide? Is that even possible? I guess it is. I'm kind of not wanting to be running into Pokemon while I have that up, so I'm just going to do that. Don't really want that. What about that life, alright? Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Huh. Are you actually kidding me? I get the TM for Toxic after Gengar's dead and it's Crunch. I actually want <laughs> that. That is cut me. I'm very cut, alright, guys. I'm very. Can I? Oh, hello.
a berry. Berry goodness. Very Christmas action. Okay, do, do, do. Oh yeah, they're probably gonna. Yeah, thought so. Come on, this way. That's right. We hear the spooky story that's supposed to scare people, right? I kind of want the item that I know is down at the bottom. So this is the house. It is a scary house, isn't it? I guess we should go inside. What? You're going inside? Are you all serious? Soon you're off spending time with Pokemon, so I guess we'll just have to go out and, and see if the rumors are true for us. So I guess so. Let's go inside by ourselves then. Cool. Well, I don't get any choice in this institutional conversation. Ho, ho, ho. Let us get started then. It was a dark and stormy night many, many years ago. Last I arrived at this house and went inside. The lights would not turn on, so I fearfully looked for the house. Eventually, I made my way into the kitchen. There was no sign of anyone being there. I found the fridge, and when I opened it, a faint light leaked out. I could finally make out my surroundings, and then I saw a faint outline of a man huddled in a corner. Look at the way this camera is zooming in. If I broke your immersion, I apologize. I tried to tell him that I was lost, and I hoped that he would stay with me until the morning. But I, when I approached him, the man suddenly screamed, Stay back! And I apologized, and continued to plead my case. Please, can you help me? I'm not talking to you, he shouted. I looked at the man in surprise. When I did this, the man asked me, Can you see them behind you? A horde of faceless men. Now then, since I told you a wonderful story that will haunt you always, would you be so kind to tip me? If you don't, you might see something really scary. You're charging us? Even haunted houses aren't free, you know. Would you like to give him a tip? Yeah, sure, why not? I don't give a shit. Yeah, you know, that was a good story. My voice is probably... Sheesh, let's get out of here. Oh, their voices merged. Huh? It's already over? I wasn't really listening. Was that story told true? Wow, I hope you enjoyed my weirdly Scottish slash bizarre accent for him. So I guess it was really a scary house in a way. Well, I want you... I know you wanted to go camping, so this is kind of camping, I guess. Here we usually tell scary stories at campfires, right? I've had enough of dark, pleasant, scary things. I'd rather rehearse my dance, but see you all later. Thanks, brah. What should I do next? I guess I'll go to Lavery Town. See you later, S-Dog. We'll prepare Pokedex soon. Yep, cool. Shauna, you want to... You just going to... Gonna hang around, I guess. Do whatever works, whatever floats your boat. Oh, I got a beat on him. That's such a... Hmm. <laughs> That's kind of pretty standard, I guess. Okay. Uh, okay then. I'm a big fan of a Blaziken if I had one. Do I even have a Torchic? If I had a Torchic, I'd probably be like, yeah, you know what? That's pretty cool. That's pretty awesome. That's pretty fancy. Yay, we're here. I just walked into a door for no reason. Okay. I'll take that. Thank you very much. It's torment. 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 Actually, we got sick items in here, bro. Cool. Thanks. I would really love. Your dad's in the. Sure. That was the most shortest story I've ever. I guess it's a short story, actually. So what kind of clothes we got? We got anything dripping in here? Hmm. Hmm. I might have to come back for those. I'm not sure yet. This music kind of pops though, actually. You can't fool me. <gasps> we can get a leverage encounter. Yo! I don't think you can surf. I think it's a rod encounter, isn't it? Don't stop me. If Serena stops me at some point, I will... Why do I... Why are you going to sneaking suspicion there's a hidden item on one of these? 
Is that just me? Are you kidding me? <laughs> Alright, if we get an Absol, Eggervolt squad. Yo! Alright, let's heal up. Alright. I had a, like, I remember... Look at, look at him in the corner, bro. Look at him. Pink freaking Mr. O dude there, creepingly looking out of a freaking Pokemon Center. What a... Oh my god. He's like, oh, he's just like standing, he's like... He's like, yo, bro. I really gotta get those, check those O powers out, bro. You know any of those O powers, bro? Alright, so... You stop me. Okay. Do you want me to show you this? Okay, I was, I'm not gonna say it. I'm not gonna say it. I know there should be a hidden item on this, isn't it? Or is it? Where is it? Oh, it's over here. I wasn't really being an item somewhere. Okay. I know for a fact if I go up those stairs, I'm probably gonna get absolutely. Um, um, actually. Alright. Fishing rod encounter. I'm down for a rotting counter. This would be a great way to end the episode off, actually. Let's see what we get. I might even add it to the team, to be honest. Like, if I get something like Ultra Fire, like straight up sourcing, like sourcing. I might even add, depending what level they are, actually. Come on. Come on. You know you want to. Come on, deep down. Oh god, did you hear that click of the button? I freaking was. It's not getting added to the team, by the way. Uh, okay. And it's level 25. Can you live a bite? Because you got a fat stack of HP, if I remember correctly. Maybe I should sell some of my Pokeball so I don't have to keep doing this to get some Ultra Balls, actually. Oh, I should have quick bought him! Remind- Oh, I should have quick bought. Oh my goodness. I should have quick bought. Anyway. Okay. Amolga, the caring Pokemon. I'm going to call you, oh you're a female as well, Joy, as in Nurse Joy, because she is the caring Pokemon, is that right? Anyway, that was garbage, that was actually garbage, I'm just going to, um, I can tell it has a massive symbol that says it's a gym, ah! oh. man that's going to be, cool, double battle, triple battle, bring her back. Is this for a water pledge? I thought so. How much does it do again? 80. Oh, I'll rest on that. I'll rest on that, bro. I'll rest on that. I'll rest on that. Thank you. Um... Do you... Wait, well, I already talked to you. What am I doing? I've already talked to you. Please no one battle me. If I go up these stairs, please don't do it. Thank you. Hey. Are you, are you, are you fucking kidding me? Are you kidding me? <laughs> oh my god, are you actually kidding me? I could have had. Are you kidding me? I could have had the candle. The legendary candle. Are you kidding? Um. That. I. <laughs> Please, please don't. Please. I can only, I can only handle so much. 
I can only handle so much. Okay, okay, that's a really weird story, okay. Oh, that's right, she told you about... <laughs> Why give me the option for the badges if you're gonna just be like, No, I don't want to. I don't want to. Wow. At least they acknowledge that you actually make freaking Pokeballs in a freaking factory, to be honest. Oh, I knew those. A dusk stone. That's actually kind of choice. Cool. You love big things. I definitely have a big thing. Terrific. I can show you the same one tomorrow, babe. <laughs> oh god, that's pretty bad. Anyway, I need to up here. That was a very event-filled episode. Um, a lot happened, I cried a lot, it's very emotionally, um, very emotional effort. But anyway, in the next episode, I guess I'll take on the gym, because it's really, I don't know what level she's going to have, so I might do some, uh, I don't know if I'll do grinding, will I do grinding? Maybe not. I don't know. I'll make up my mind. Anyway, I'll see you guys in the next episode. I'll figure it out. I might train up GoGo. -Go, I might not. I have no plan of what I'm going to do. Because it's hard to kind of grind him up because the rest of my team is so much more stronger. But I'll see how we go. But anyway, guys, I'll see you guys in the next episode. Have a beautiful day and I'll see you guys in the next one whenever that is. Bye, guys.